What is going on guys? It is the Phantom Michael and I'm bringing you the next episode of our Pokemon Sword Nuzlocke Challenge. If you guys have not seen the last episodes, be sure to go back and check them out. Your support is always greatly appreciated on that. Let's do a quick team recap before we get started. Up first we have Bear Trap with the moves Sucker Punch, Bounce Revenge, and Bulldoze. We have Struggle Bug with Reflect, Light Screen, and Psychic. We have Toxtricity with Nuzzle, Overdrive, Toxic, and Poison Jab. We have Agent with Sucker Punch, Tearful Look, U-Turn, and Snapshot. We have Iggy with Counter, Rest, Takedown, and Night Slash. And we have Morgrim with False Surrender, Dark Pulse, Swagger, and Ready Kiss. So, let's keep it going. <clears throat> We've defeated everybody south of us, so we're going to keep checking on this little circle here. Let's talk to Granddad here. Nothing. What's in here? This kind of looks like a hotel, I think. It is a hotel, look at that. Huh. I wonder if this is like the Alolan place like that. Anything? <coughs> Do you think we should head to I'd like to get some sightseeing in along with Kit watching the champion cup. Okay. Can I go upstairs? I can. It's up here. Dude, this is totally like the Alolan, uh... Oh gosh, it's Master Ken and Ryu. Is there anything over here? One bed, guys. Interesting. Only after you master basic moves can you engage in more advanced battles. That's why I learned from karate. I heard that some of the wild Pokemon soak in hot springs to heal their injured bodies. Okay. Yeah, this is totally like the same rooms and everything, it seems like. My partner is germaphobe. It's he's been it's been taking a shower forever, even though it's ground type. <laughs> That's funny. I wonder what Pokemon that is. I wonder what Pokemon that is. Can we can we ride our bikes in here? Nope. Can't. Ever since I was a kid, the hallways of hotels have always made me feel like I've got got lost somewhere. Huh. Oh, there's a, whoa. Do you like Pokemon? Yes. Well, thanks for that. I hope you've always loved them. Hello there. What's this? Did you need something for me? Right. Why don't you run along for now? But come back when you're as strong as a champion, would you? Oh, dude, is this the Game Freak headquarters right here? I feel like it is. I'm completely obsessed with Rotom Rally. I can't get enough of it. We came here to research a bit, but the gallery region is lovely, isn't it? The best part of, of all had to be enjoying the different toppings on all the curries. Curry's a big hit in Kanto, too, you know. Cool Kanto mention right there. Sweet. <clears throat> Hear that background music? Yep, I made that. Yeah, I do totally call that. I'm a planner. My job is to think of ways to play, so I'm supposed that means that playing my, itself is my job. Hi, I'm the director. Well, look at you. You're trying to include the Pokedex, aren't you? Thanks for that. Keep on searching out new Pokemon to catch. Oh, I know. I've got just the thing to help you. Catch more and more Pokemon. The catching charm? What? Holding it is said to increase the chance of getting a critical catch. Curious that the charm doesn't shake much. Come back and tell me when you complete the Pokedex of yours. Cool, dude. Oh, I missed again. It's harder than it looks to get a catch. You, you look like you know the proper way to throw a Pokeball. She's talking about Pokemon Go right there. But uh, so this this hotel is the game game <coughs> game freak headquarters. <coughs> so. That, that cop gave it away when he said, come back when you're as strong as the champion. So. Well, we have a catching charm, so that's interesting. Seems like the hot spring is the perfect temperature today. Can you just climb in there? Is there a way to get in there? Nope. So we've talked to them. We've gone over here. What does this guy say? Yep. Look at you. Muscles, no. Muscles, no cold is too cold if you have powerful muscles to keep you warm. 
Route 9, new encounter, boy. Where's this lead to, though? Huh, better. Just keep doing what I've been doing. Huh. Are there new haircuts here? Are there new hairstyles here? I don't think there are. I changed my hair. Yeah, cool. If only there was new hairstyles here, then it would be worth going in there. Ooh, there's a clothing shop. Maybe they got better clothes here, too. This is a big town compared. Hey, Snow Run. Plenty of snow and the ice are so deep. Now will it become a glalie or a frost lass? Well, you have to murder it to become the frost lass, so. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, there we go. If you complete your Pokedex, I'm sure you'll feel a great sense of accomplishment. Oh, I intend to. What's in here? I love having snowball fights with my Pokemon. Yes, you do. Anything else? Anything else? New clothing would be nice, dude. Let's see. Torn top? No. 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 No, no. Hmm. Jack would be cool. No pants. Uh -huh. I ain't gonna lie. I like either those shoes or these shoes. Nope. What the hell? Hoodie would be cool. Satin varsity jacket. Looks like a pie at Pilgrim player, dude. That's awesome. Uh, nightshade. Pikachu Payback. Astonished Eevee. Literally, they are... Oh. No, it's not. Look at this. Eevee's knocked out in the back. Pikachu Payback. Nice. Eevee's knocked out right there. Pikachu's knocked out right there. That's cool. That's a pretty interesting shirt. Uh... Anything? Nope. Three-fourth sleeve bottom? <clears throat> I'll take it. Wait, dude. The very first assignment. Oh, are you all done shopping for now? Yes. I need to put it on. I did not put it on. Shirt at there it is. <coughs> I think I like those better. Do I have socks? Got some black ankle socks. Ugh. There's some big freaking shoes, dude.
That's not what I wanted. Uh. Now I have to go back in to reset it. I'll change the one thing. There. There we go. I look decent. I need some better pants. Alright. Let's check down here real quick. Alright. Poke a doll. Nice little fellow. Okay, you took me right back around. Uh, cut down here real quick. <clears throat> I'm gonna go in here first. Dude, these little bug ice types are everywhere. I thought that was a Noivern, but I thought that was like a different evolution. Because of how he was standing for a second. Okay, cool. Anything would be nice. Anything would be nice. Whoa, Pikachu guy. Tears are powerful. When I see them, I let my guard down without this. <coughs> hey, tears, cool. Look at all these Pikachus. I'll become champion using all Pikachu team. I bet you will, buddy. I bet you will. And then you'll get beat by her quick. The sounds of scratching glass or screeching noise feel like... Okay. Screech. Thanks. I've never gotten so many useless TMs in an entire Pokemon game ever. Never have I ever gotten a whole bunch of useless. Oh, there's Umbreon. I've been waiting for my life. Well, actually, my wife's been making me wait. But being blunt with someone isn't always the right thing to do. Let me get Shorts in here. Whoa. So that means the culprit must be among us. Wait, who are you? After all the trouble of deducing things, don't go messing it up now. Aha! We're accused of being criminals. Can you help us out? Hmm. I just want to let go, so... Where did my Pokemon go off to? So it's a Pokemon that might be the criminal here. Cough, I suppose I should introduce myself. The name's Houses. Yes, that Houses. The great detective. I've been hired by the hotel. At present, I have conferred the culprit of a most heinous crime. And that crime is... The strange case of who ate the large quantity of berries in the lobby. I've gathered the three people who were present in the lobby at the time of the crime. But because of the noise, my marvelous deductive reasoning seems somewhat muddled at present. That's it, you inferior child. You will be my assistant. Listen to the stories of each suspect and find the culprit. Where did my Pokemon go off to? Huh? Berries, I didn't eat them. Hey, you haven't seen my Pokemon around here, have you? That detective sure seems like trouble, doesn't he? I'll admit that I saw all the mountain of berries, but my doctor told me to stop eating those things. I've got it in writing right here. Looks like you were unlucky enough to get caught up in this too. It was a huge pile of berries in the lobby right there. No way I could have eaten that many. I've been saying that this whole time. Ah, there he is. Ah, oh, my Pokemon, where were you? That is the berry Pokemon right there. It sure has a lot of berry juice in its mouth. Aha! After listening to everyone's accounts, I have deduced the culprit. Dancer, you are the culprit. 
Why me? Because you're a dancer. You move and shake your body so much that you need all that food for extra energy. That's evidence as clear and sharp as the leak of far-fetched. What? What does that even mean? You're no detective. You're a fraud. Who are you calling a fraud? You can't be referring to me, the great detective. I can't deal with this disrespect. I leave it to you. You find the culprit. Yes. It's right here. Yes. <clears throat> what? That Squobit is the one responsible? Oh, it's true. It's got berry bits around its mouth. Yes, it definitely ate the berries. Definitely. Oh, you're right. I see it, it now that I look more closely. Come on, chow. As, as expected of my assistant. Here, we're solving the mystery. Take this. Okay. Split it. Just split it. I'm overjoyed. I must be up now. Take care, everyone. Hey, you wait just a minute. Is I'm supposed to chase after him too? All right, Squobit. Got the wide lens. Rubbish, rubbish. Rubbish is so helpful. Eat rubbish instead of taking tips. Good job. Good job, Trubbish. All that for a wide lens and two TMs, screech and fake tears. Worth it? I don't know. Probably not. Uh, let's go down here for a moment. Ooh, hello. Flitter, flitter. Almost done exploring that whole town. Icy wind. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. Not bad at all. I don't know. The way their flames wave is so strange. Watching it makes me feel so calm. Keep on going. I wanted to have my fridge blown to the side in a hair salon too. Eh. Yeah, I can see that I guess. Not really. What the heck is this place? Ooh. But oh now. The food here is out of this world. It's worth coming here just for this, even if it means going out of your way. Trying to ruin your food. Hello there, welcome to Bob's. Your uncle. You're not leaving here without enjoying a delicious meal first. I would love some. Cooked perfection. Well, I would like to try some. Can I eat some food? It's not. Just for show, I guess. Could have been used for something good. Alright. Talk to everybody. Ooh, they know my name. Yes. Hmm, Draco Meteor, I'm sure. Is that a Persian engraved on this wall? An ancient hero's bath. It is said that heroes bathe here to heal and rest. <clears throat> Sickle spear. Just what I needed. Alright. The stone paving on the ground are quite cold. Snow piles up on them in, in no time. 
Good to know. Darumaka. Darumaka. See anything else? Let's get it, Ice Type Gym Leader. Oh, I lost. It all went to pot. There must have been something wrong with my strategy, but I did what I what I've seen Lee do in battles. Here, take it. It's the Rock Leader's League card. You should check out the gym leader. You'll have to face two. This is rock, not ice. And me, I've got to figure out what to put on my team once and for all, and no more of this doubting. <coughs> so is this a rock place? Oh, hello there, thanks for rolling by and to have a chat with your mate, ball guy. What'd you get for me? Moon ball, sweet. I like it. Let's talk to you then, friend. Talk to you. Hmm. Very interested. Uh, am I good on super potions? I'm good on potions, so. Yep, let's roll. Let's go. Let's go, girl. Make sure to receive the trap detector up ahead. Trap detector. The trap detector, she says. Hmm. Odd that this is a rock type gym leader. Really odd. Hmm. Would you like to hear the details of the gym mission carried out here? Then allow me to explain a little about the trap detector you hold in your hands. The reason you'll need it is simple. There are invisible pitfalls everywhere in here. If you fall into one, you'll have to start again from the last platform you reached. The detector will vibrate when there's a pitfall in front of you. The closer the hole, the stronger the vibration. Okay. Then on with you. Good luck. Okay. Let's see what we got. <coughs> Boldor it is. Boldor. Bear Trap's gonna run rampant in this place. Revenge. Boldor is literally going to run rampant in this place. Good idea. Mud slap. That didn't do anything. Nothing at all. Bow doors down. Ooh, it's a crit. Did the crit matter? Probably not. Probably not. Hmm. 
Wow, dude. Very sensitive. Totally just stick with the bear trap. Ooh, crustal. This should be easy. X scissor should be nothing. Literally nothing. Oh, let's just try to do those one time. Ooh, stealth rockin'. <clears throat> Ooh, I hope I get stealth rock from her. That'd be awesome. Or him. Yes, the dude. Stealth rockin' would be nice. Ooh. Sucker punch in. Okay, that was it. It's fine, Wendy. Ah, sturdy pseudo -wudo. stupid. <coughs> Guess I hate not being able to oak or something. That's what I hate. Ah, I'll drop your speed. Oh, oh! I didn't think my wood hammer being a thing, dude. Dude, that's good to know. Wood hammer could be problematic. 
Wood hammer could totally be problematic later on. Hmm. Something good to think about right there. Come on, we can do it. We can make it. Ah. Eventually we'll make it. Aha! Shit. There we go. Would you look at that big old thing right there? Oh boy. That right there would have been a doozy. Now, Jim Challenge, you me in the There we go. I did it. I did it. All right. All right. Bag. Heal. Heal again. Let's go, Phantom. This is going to be a longer episode, guys. Sorry. Hey there, the name's Gordy. I admit I feel a little bad for doing this to you, Gym Challenger, but I'm going to use this match to show the crowd that my Pokemon are unbeatable. So let's get this over with, Challenger. Alright, Gordy. <clears throat> Four Pokemon. Water rock. It's fine. Water rock type. Uh, I don't know why he shook like that. Shell smash. Okay. <clears throat> That's fine. I ain't worried about it. That's what I'm talking about. I don't think you can stop me with the awkward shit. Bear trap. We lost bear trap. That is sad. Ugh, bear trap is such a good Pokemon. Shuffle. Shuffle. Is it Galorian shuffle? Is it a shiny shuffle? I love shuffle. 
can't believe they're making me fight my one of my favorite Pokemon. One-shotted, Audi, and you're two levels above me. want to climb into a hole. Well, I guess it'd be more like falling from here. There we go. That was impressive. Rules are rules. Here, take this rock badge. Nash. Nice. You can now catch Pokemon up to level 50. Oh, don't worry about me. I just need to train harder, that's all. As celebration of victory, Gordy take his team. Oh, that was stealth rocks. Got the, the rock uniform actually looks cool. I ain't gonna lie. I'm surprised this wasn't ice, man. Hmm. That battle was brilliant. That gym leader was tough, but you had no trouble. Sir Chester has some really great restaurants. I got some things I want to talk to you about. So let's head to the restaurant to celebrate your win. The name of the restaurant's Bob is your uncle. Bob is your uncle. Bob is your uncle. Okay. Aha! 2x special attack. Oh, what are we doing, guys? What are we doing? I am so sorry. Got that gym badge, Phantom. Nice one. Oh, hey. There you are. I've been trying to find out more about the Darkest Day and the Sword and Shield Pokemon, but still no luck. Wait, hold on.
No way, what's this? A new chapter of the Old Gomorrah Legends? A fifth tapestry? An absolute fantastic poster? The heroes look sad. And where are the sword and the shield? What was the meaning of this picture? An end of the legend? Hmm, perhaps when their duty was complete, they went into some kind of sleep. Based on those statues we saw back in the stolen side, the sword and the shield were actually two Pokemon, right? That's right. That's my take on it, at least. You remember the Pokemon we met that day? Do you think it could have been one of them? Either the sword or the shield Pokemon? You met them? Come on, you know what I'm talking about, right, Phantom? In the slumbering world? Exactly. The mad Pokemon ran into in the fog. Don't you think that could have been it? Oh, that's right. You lot were ha have been in the slumbering world. I only started on this journey because my grand told me to, but this is turning out to be too much fun. You've got to tell me more. How about we discuss this over a meal? Go on. What do you want to eat? Let's get our orders in. Fascinating. Alright, the next thing we do now is when we're done eating is to have a look around Sir Chester. Let's inspect the hero's bath. Cool. Alright, you guys, I apologize for taking so long, but let's end the episode here. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please smash the like button. Your support is greatly appreciated. But with that, I'm the Phantom Michael. I'm going to get the heck out of here. I will see you guys in the next one.